You may have received news about some of the email compliance changes that inbox providers like Google and Yahoo are making, or have been met with instructions about verifying your domain with DKIM, SVF, and DMARC. These changes can feel confusing and overwhelming, but don't worry, I'm here to make sure you understand what's happening and the steps that you can take to protect your sender reputation and your business. Hi, I'm Jordan from Flowdesk, the world's most intuitive email marketing platform that empowers small business owners with everything they need to beautifully grow, nurture, and monetize their email list. Starting in early February, 2024, major inbox providers like Gmail and Yahoo are requiring certain senders to meet a new standard of email authentication. While these authentication standards have long been considered best practices, they'll now be required in order to ensure a high deliverability rate and staying out of the spam box. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the steps of how to verify your domain via DKIM, SPF, and DMARC manually. First, log into your Flowdesk account and navigate to My Account Domain Setup. Here, you'll be able to see each of the email sending domains that are tied to your Flowdesk account. Today, we are going to be verifying the domain addywilkinsconsulting.com. If you haven't started the authentication process before, you could click on the Verify Now button and then select the option to add records manually by clicking I'll do it manually. Select Next. You should be taken to a screen where you can see all of the records you'll need to manually copy and paste into your DNS management tool. Depending on your account setup, you'll either see five sets of records or three sets of records. If your account has five sets of records, you'll have one SPF record, three sets of DKIM records, and one DMARC record. If your account has three sets of records, you'll have one SPF record, one DKIM record, and one DMARC record. Next, open a separate browser tab and sign into your domain provider's account. If you're watching this video, your domain provider should be GoDaddy. For the sake of this example, I'm already logged into my GoDaddy account. Within GoDaddy, I can navigate to the domains I own by selecting My Products from the drop-down menu in the right-hand corner of the screen. Here, I can see that I own the domain addywilkinsconsulting.com. I can quickly access my domain's DNS settings, which is where I'll need to copy and paste records from my Flowdesk account, by clicking on the DNS button. This should open up your DNS records in GoDaddy. Now, let's pause for a moment and navigate back to the tab that has your Flowdesk domain verification open. Use the built-in copy buttons to copy your relevant missing records and then paste them into your GoDaddy account. You'll need to add the DKIM and SPF records as CNAME records and the DMARC record as a TXT record. Let's copy and paste this first DKIM record from Flowdesk into your GoDaddy's DNS records. First, copy the CNAME host from Flowdesk and paste it into the section titled Name at the top of your DNS records. This is a CNAME record, so you'll want to select CNAME as the record type. Next, copy and paste the corresponding CNAME value from Flowdesk into the value section in GoDaddy. Select custom from the TTL dropdown in GoDaddy and input the value 600. Click save, double check the record and click save again. You'll repeat this process for all of the DKIM, SPF and DMARC records listed inside of your Flowdesk account until everything has been copy and pasted into GoDaddy. Make sure you select TXT as the record type for your DMARC policy. After manually entering your authentication records, navigate back to the open tab with your Flowdesk domain authentication, click next, and select done. The domain verification card will initially show as pending for up to 48 hours as this is the time it could take for your domain to be verified. I recommend waiting 24 to 48 hours before coming back to check and see if your domain has been successfully authenticated. And that's it, you're done. You've successfully completed the steps to verify your domain, protecting your sender reputation and ensuring that your email marketing could keep on humming. If you need more help learning how to verify your domain, 
visit our help center at help.flowdesk.com or reach out to our member experience team at support at flowdesk.com. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel to continue learning best practices to grow, nurture, and monetize your email list. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks so much for listening.